Bobek has been through it all the past few years. Triumph, defeat, illness, and tragedy. It's made her grow up in a hurry. Brent Musburger takes a closer look. When I'm out there, I feel so much mature compared to Tara and Rochelle, actually, that it's, I feel like a woman. I really do when I'm out there on the ice. Just the fact that I've been skating longer and that I've been through so much. Nicole has experienced so many emotions in her 20 years, but nothing compares to last year when she was reunited with her childhood coach and surrogate father, Carlo Fossi. When I came back to Carlo, because I've took from him in the past, I felt a new door opening. Just he gave me back the love and the sport that I missed for so long. Her bronze at the Nationals earned her a return to the World Championships, a site of previous glory. But a day before her first program, Carlo Fossi suffered a fatal heart attack. Nicole decided to skate, but it was a difficult experience. When I got back on the ice for the first time after he died, it was hard, very hard. I wasn't sure, you know, should I continue? What should I do? She came to him when she was just a little girl, and it was from the first day on, they really had kind of a love together. Carlos' wife took over as Nicole's primary coach following his death. Nicole has been guided by men through much of her career, and the dynamic is much different. It's a little different with me working with a female instead of a male. I think that I worked with males for a long time and um, kind of a different training situation. And I'm working with Krista and Elena, and it's quite a female atmosphere. <laughs> Working with Elena has been like a dream come true. She has so much emotion and she really knows how to express it and also bring it out of me even more. If you watch it, her, she's different. She's different now. She's more sophisticated. It's like a brilliant future. I hope. This year it's the biggest final of all to make it to the Olympics and uh, it's something I've wanted for a long time and I believe it's time. I believe I'm gonna make it and just, you know, surprise everyone. As for future plans, I haven't really set my mind on anything. Um, if it was my choice, I'd say, okay, I win nationals, I win Olympics, I win worlds, turn professional, you know? But hey, who said I can't dream, right? <laughs>